Johannes, congratulations. What a great performance. Can you tell, first of all, about the competition today? Uh, it was a uh, quite nervous competition. Uh, I felt uh, pressure from, from start today and uh, took time on my prone shooting to, to try and secure five uh, targets. Uh, it's a bit of a risk when you shoot uh, that slow, uh, but when I hit five, it, I, my bet was uh, a good bet and uh, yeah, coming into the standing I was uh, with quite high pulls but uh, yeah, three seconds before I started to shoot I, I felt relaxed and, uh, and I was quite confident. And you seem to be in the zone that very few really great champions can achieve and not always. How do you get to this, what it looks a very special focus we see on your face? Yeah, it's, uh, I've, I've found like... Uh, uh, my way of, uh, of of thinking and preparing for the race, and uh, sometimes you succeed, uh, sometimes not. But for now, I've uh, now had my fourth uh, win in a row for the individual race, and and uh, yeah, I'm in a good uh, good mood, good uh, good position uh, in the field. Also with uh, our wax tech and uh, coaches, our staff, we make a very good job and. Uh, I I am focused now to uh, to stop the season uh, or to yeah continue the 100% focus until the season is uh, finished. And how demanding it is to live almost hour by hour, not knowing what what the program will be or what decision might be. Yeah, this uh, thing has been for all athletes to to follow the news picture and and see uh, see what happens uh, it gets uh, worse uh, every hour and uh, and yeah the last hour before we went to the race we saw schools and uh, and sports in norway are closed now uh, maybe they will close down airports uh, so it's uh, very big news uh, not only in norway but for the whole uh, for the whole world and um, yeah it will be interesting to see what will happen uh, <laughs> Yeah, the next hour, the next uh, days, we'll see. Thank you, congratulations. Thank you. Martin, I think a fantastic performance. Your two wins without Johannes aside, is this your best sprint from purely biathlon perspective of the season? Uh, it was uh, an amazing sprint today because uh, many athletes shot clean, uh, many of the best ones shot clean, and it was really challenging uh, to, be, uh, to be on the podium today. I'm really proud. Uh, I uh, achieved to, to be on that podium today. Really proud. I succeed to to secure the sprint Cliscale Globe today if the season ends on uh, Sunday. So uh, it's only positive for me today. There is no negative points. And uh, did you know you would have this much power still in your legs at this stage of the season? You beat Johannes in the last loop when you both knew it's it's about first and second place. Yeah, of course, uh, I knew that uh, I'm uh, able to do good things. You know, last season has been uh, really challenging for me and uh, I struggled a lot uh, and I'm really proud. Uh, it's a big pride about uh, being able to, to be back on that position. So honestly, uh, that's uh, probably one of the biggest victories in my career. And uh, being seg second or first in the World Cup will not change anything to that pride. So it's why uh, I want to enjoy the positive today and uh, being satisfied about my uh, second place today. And living day by day in this, um, this yeah. strange conditions when nobody lived through this. Is there any experience from your career you can draw on to prepare for the competition? Yeah, of course, uh, it's totally different. But, you know, uh, when you look like at uh, postponement for um, for fog, for example, uh, like we had in Sochi 2014 in the mass start, it's the same kind of conditions. You are going to the competition, but you don't know you, if you will compete or not. You need to be, stay focused, to relax, stay focused again. People are talking. You some uh, once the competition is cancelled, someone to compete anyway. So I think, of course, it's uh, nothing uh, the same than a, uh, than a, a virus, but. Uh, on the port side, it's, uh, I think, uh, uh, an experience I have who helped me on that uh, kind of situation. Emilien, seventh podium of the season. What went well again today? Uh, yeah, seventh podium, uh, it's quite amazing. Uh, this morning, 
I, wo I woke up and uh, I thought about my sixth podium and I was really proud and happy and uh, I was a little bit mentally tired and yeah in my head it was oh it's, it's a nice season for me and for sure I always want more and uh, I think at the start of the uh, of the race today, I thought about that, uh, make uh, the best possible today for me. It was uh, so perfect shooting and on skis it was, uh, it was quite good, better than I thought. So yeah, I'm really proud and happy to have this seven podium and uh, one with Martin again. It's, uh, it's pretty nice and uh, no, I'm uh, really, uh, I will not say confident, but really focused for the pursuit. Uh, I have the red bib and uh, I want to have it uh, after this World Cup, so I will uh, make everything possible to to keep it against uh, Johannes Martin and to be a huge fight. And with so you reach so many milestones in your career this season. What keeps you motivating? It's also exhausting season. Yeah, for sure. That's why I wanted to to tell you before uh, this year. It's so amazing and new for me, you know, to be world champion, to make podiums. Uh, it's a new way of practice my uh, biathlon and uh, yeah, that's why I'm tired now. Uh, just on, I just want to, to be at home, stay uh, relaxed without races and whew, be calm and uh, remember all the race and be proud of that I made everything uh, I did this year. But yeah, I just have to always be focused on my biathlon, just think about how I can make it or I made my performance before. And uh, as today, you know, uh, for me, I was not at my top, but I just do my job. It was a good uh, shooting uh, with technique and speed and on shooting uh, on speed uh, on ski. Sorry, it was the same. So, yeah, I think it's my way to, to make my biathlon. Jo just think about how I made it and know about results. When you go for the podium, do you feel when you be, uh, battle man to man? you have an advantage over other people? I don't know, it, it depends on the race, but for sure um, uh, this year and now, uh, if I have to, to fight for a podium or for win a race, it will be different for me. I know I'm able to do it, I can be fast on sprint. So yeah, I know now I'm not the young guy who have to improve in himself and uh, to him to fight for a podium is a new thing. No, for me it's no, it's my place, and uh, yeah, uh, for sure the, the other guys will not uh, send me gifts uh, for next sprint. Thank you and congratulations. Thank you.